Hey everybody, John Grimaldi here. Today we're going to learn how to play Christmas Vacation by Descendants. Let's get into it. Okay, what are we doing here? We're playing a D chord. We're starting with the open string on the D. 2nd fret on the G, 3rd fret on the B, and 3rd fret on the E. I feel comfortable playing this open, and then my index finger on the 2nd fret, my middle finger on the B string on the 3rd fret, and then my pinky on the 3rd fret E string. Because we're going to need to remove it, this will be a little bit easier. Uh, so the first the first chord when they start and it's uh, it's not full gain they turn it's uh, you know may, maybe half volume um, so it's going to be two strokes of that and then remove the pinky so it's going to be open D string uh, second fret on the G third fret on the B and now second fret on the E. So we're going from to all we're doing is removing our pinky and our middle finger is going to play the second fret uh, E string. And then we're going to follow suit. We're going to remove the middle finger and then play the open E string. Um, the index finger and your middle finger stay in the same spot. is what we're looking for. It's two, two, and one, like a. Then we move to a G flat or F sharp bar chord. That's gonna be second fret, low E string, A string, fourth fret, D string, and then you're gonna bar the G, the B, and the E with your index finger. So we're playing this bar, and then we're playing uh, the fifth and the eighth, I guess, octave. Um, so this is going to be a minor chord. So you want to strum through it and then kind of leave it strumming the higher strings. Then we're going to a G chord. And I'm playing this 3rd um, fret low E, 2nd fret A. The D and the G are open. I'm playing the third fret on the B string and I'm leaving the E string open. And then it's an E. I think he plays the high, like a high E power chord up here and then maybe uh, the low E string. Kind of alternates back and forth. slow then we get into the next part which would be the verse um, where the vocals and everybody comes in. Full volume, palm muted, power chords here. And then the B is open, you can play it here. Or you can play it here. Sound a little different, depends on, on what you like. You A little easier, probably keep your hand here. Um, this sounds a little thicker, beefier. So we're playing the second fret on the E string and then the 4th fret on the A string and then also I play the 4th fret uh, the octave of it, just a bigger chord on the D string 
we're going to palm mute it. So we're going to rest our palm here on the bridge, muting these strings when we do uh, down strokes. Second fret, and then we're going to move this whole pattern up to the third fret. Back down. Then we're going to play an, a B string, but it's an open chord. We've been palm muting this whole time. Now we're going to play an open. This would be the pre-chorus, um, and it's just a, a D to a G. And then we go back to the beginning. It's the same chords, just uh, what's open and what's what's closed. So that part is a. Uh the only difference is you palm mute that B. So we do that twice, and then uh, open up. long, practice long, jam long. All right. Thanks very much. We'll be back soon. Till next time. Keep rocking.